Uh, we're going to have our wet and our dry ingredients separate so we can mix them after. So on our dry ingredient side, we have two cups of flour, all-purpose flour, half a teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of baking soda, not powder, but soda. Make sure that's level. And the, this recipe you can use nuts or not. Uh, I am going to put a half cup of chopped walnuts in it. I'm just gonna make sure that's all blended together. And after we mix our wet ingredients, we will combine them both. So our wet ingredients, we have a half a cup of butter or a stick of butter. I'm gonna put the whole thing, I like to cube it up so it's easier to mix. You're going to want to cream that together with your sugar. So let's get that mixed up together a little bit here. Two eggs in here. And then you're going to want um, for your bananas, you want them to be overripe. You're going to want them to be brown. Um, I have an extra here. You're going to want them to be like at least this brown. And this bowl is the two mashed bananas. And that's where our wet ingredients here. Incorporate those. A little extract. that together our dry ingredients you do, sometimes you have to add dry ingredients um, a little at a time but for this bread recipe you can just put them right into the wet mix so you're gonna want this to come together but also not over mix it Three hundred fifty degrees, fifty to sixty minutes, and we'll see what happens when it comes out.